thank you for reaching FTC4 production. Welcome into my channel again and today I have a very very good cool feature, cool app that parents may use nowadays for their children protection. And it's called the FD FBI Child ID app. If you're shopping at the mall with your children when one of them suddenly suddenly disappear, a quick search of the nearby area is unsuccessful. What do you do? Now there is an, a free new tool from the FBI that can help you. Our child child ID app, the first mobile application created by the FBI, provides a convenient place to electronically store pictures and other vital information about your children so that is literally right at the hand if you need it. You can show the pictures and provide physical identifiers such as height and weight to secure or police officers, I mean security or police officers on the spot. Using a specific a special tab on the app which pretty much you can see here in this display. You can also quick and easily email the information to the authority with a few clicks. The app includes tips on keeping children safe as well as um, a specific guidance on what, um, on what to do if, if it those first few crucial hour, hours after you, a child goes missing. If it features a password. It features a password protection option to help to help keep your information safe and allow you to add pictures from your mobile phone image library. You can also zoom it and crop it images prior prior saving. Um, the app is available to the, for downloading iPhones through iTunes and on Android phones through Google Play too. Um, something else that you need to know is, is that the FBI is not collecting or storing any f photos or information that you enter into the app. That's something really important to know. You probably might be wondering, oh, I'm not going to put the picture of my child into the FBI, FBI database so they actually know more information about my one of my family members, stuff like that. No. All data resides solely on your mobile device unless you need it to send it to the authorities. You please read your mobile provider's terms of service for information about the security or application store on your device. Put your child's safety in your own hands. You have to download this today. Okay? Um, Right here, the FBI Child ID app. Um, according to, I mean, a child goes missing every 40 seconds in America. Many never to return home. The FBI FBI new Child ID app can help. Simply download the free FBI mobile application from the App Store on iTunes, and the latest photos of your child. Enter the key information about him or her, and update it regularly. Um, right there, you can see it. That's the logo. Hopefully, none of you have to go through something like this. But in case so you do, this is a very good tool that you can use and provide it to the authorities immediately. I mean, if you like the sample that I was telling you about the mall, you lose your child every single second counts, ladies and gentlemen. And if you have this handy on your cell phone, you can provide it to the authority immediately. And they can take action right away. But if you don't have this type of information on yourself, I mean, what are the chances that the perpetrator can get away with it? You know? But if you provide this to the authority right quick on the spot and you show the picture on everybody around, they can actually tell right away, oh my god, I, I remember that kid. I saw her at the entrance on the mall with a lady getting out. You see what I'm talking about? You 
everybody has to be smart on this. Okay? Um, safety tips. The following tips will help you keep your children safe. Make sure that your child knows his and full name, your full name, your address, and your telephone number, including the area code. Make sure that your child know how to use the telephone and know how to dial, I mean, call 911. This is when we're dealing with a toddler, you know, like in five, six, seven years old. Do not leave your children home alone. You must leave your teenager children at home by themselves. Tell them not to answer the door. If they answer the telephone, they should not mention that they are alone, but you should say that you will be back shortly. Tell your children to move away from cars that pull up beside them if they don't know who the driver is. Even if the driver claims to know you, you sh if your child is being followed, they should know to run home or go to a safe house to the nearest public place. This is an instructions that you at least should be concerned about if you have children and you gotta teach them, you know, how to follow up at all time. Um, you gotta maintain up-to-date identification information on your children at all time including medical and dental records, social security number, photograph, photograph etc. Um, fingerprints and DNA sample also can be collected and stored in your home through the National Child Identification Program Kit, which you can actually get them in here, uh, childdprogram.com forward slash the ID kit which is provided by the American Football Coaches Association in partnership with the FBI. Here, you got instructions on how to use the child app. You open the app and click the plus sign in the upper right corner of the home page. Add the pictures, optional, which I would strongly recommend to do that. And click the blue new photo album, you can, you know, Check these instructions at the FBI.gov. Um, you can find all the information in there. See, this is another sample. The first 48 hours following the disappearance of a child are the most crucial to the possibility of a successful recovery. Use the following checklist during the first 24 hours to help increase your chances of locating your child. If more time than this had passed, still ensure that these items are addressed as quickly as possible. This is why I brought it up to you, the importance. I'm pretty sure that many of you parents do not or do not know that this feature was available out there. Now that you know, you can use it and keep it in your cell phone. Uh, immediately call 911 on the nearest law enfor enforcement agency. If you don't know the nearest local law, for local law enforcement agency, a 911 operator can direct, direct you. Once in contact with investigators, ask to have your missing child put into the FBI National Crime Information Center, missing per, uh, person file, there is no waiting period. Request that the FBI be involved in the search of your child. It can be done at no cost. Gather and provide as much information as you can about your child to help investigators. Send any information from you, the child's ID app, provide a description of what your child was wearing, any personal item he or she may have possessed at the time of the disappearance that will help the authority to follow up. Request that the law enforcement put out a bottle be on the locked out in the looked out bulletin for your child and ask your local law enforcement agency to organize a search for your child. Request tracking of training dogs, preferably uh, blood, I mean bloodhounds in the search effort. Um, you have seen the, uh, ask the law enforcement agency about the Amber Alert program, which it triggered many cell phones around the area. You have seen that before. And yeah, like I told you, the first 24 hours are really important. This all this information, again, you can find it at the FBI.gov files. I saw it. It's a free app, and I thought that it would be really important 
to share this information with all the parents out there. I got children myself and I thought it would be really important for you and for us, for anyone who had children to have this information. Um, I know that this particular video was for the app itself, but I'm providing additional information um, in case that you would like to have them. Uh, the child adop adoption resources for both in my family. You can go here. I'm gonna leave it in here a little bit so you can write it down. You can actually, you know, hit the pause button on my video and write down all the information. This is the information that probably you didn't know that were available for all of you. Um, is there? Hopefully, none of you have to go through something like this. But in case you do here is the places that you can go and double check again i thought it would be very important for me to put a grain of sand i mean a grain of sand to my community and provide this important app content information to all of you out there if you have a child if you have children and you normally you know go to different places and you probably seen yourself in situation like this use this app it can help you you never know okay um, and nothing uh, this is what I wanted to share with you uh, with all of you and I hope it's uh, um, this app actually come handy to you use it and it's really important I can keep our children safe thanks for reaching my channel FDC for production and have a wonderful day bye bye